The recommended gap between COVID-19 vaccine shots for 5 to 11-year-olds is 8 weeks, but the highly transmissible Omicron variant has many parents worried that the wait is too long, and in the meantime, their children are less protected. Toronto's Associate Medical Officer of Health addressed their concerns in our weekly COVID-19 Q&A. And it's really about a balancing act. Uh, the National Advisory Committee on Immunization reviewed this uh, before uh, in December, even when Omicron was here. Mm-hmm. And what we know about Omicron and the vaccines are that two doses don't necessarily prevent you from getting Omicron. We know that you really need that third booster dose. That's the one that gives you better efficacy against getting infected. We also know in children, we want them to get the best immune response after that second dose, and we want it to last because right now there is no recommendation for booster doses. And so while we're right now in the thick of Omicron, Actually, the recommendation is to to still wait to get that second dose at the eight-week interval because, again, getting that second dose earlier is not going to necessarily prevent them from getting Omicron. The two doses of vaccine are not proving to be as highly effective against Omicron. And by waiting, you know, another few weeks, um, when they get it, they'll get that better immune response and it will last them. And we have to really think beyond Omicron here as well, too. Well, I know that there's, you know, big hopes that this will be our last wave. It's really hard from a science perspective to be able to to predict that. And, you know, we have to be prepared. There could be another wave after this. And we want to make sure that our children especially have that uh, protection um, where, it, where it may make a difference as well, too. For more answers from this Q&A, including one about new masking guidelines, you can go to our website citynews.ca. For City News, I'm Dilshad Berman.